questions today about how a sixth grader died at school. KCAL 9's Adriana Weingold live in Colton. She's got the very latest on this investigation. Adriana. Well, Sandra, an absolutely tragic situation out here. You have a family grieving the loss of their 12 year old son, Dominic Gallegos. The sixth grader died yesterday afternoon in PE class. We want to show you a picture of him. We spoke to his father this morning who told us his son was in PE class when he tripped and fell to the ground. That's when Dominic's friends say they saw another kid step on his chest repeatedly. When he stopped breathing, they say the bully then shook him. Now, after the bell rang, we're told the teacher made his way to Dominic and started CPR. Paramedics then arrived and took him to the hospital, but Dominic was pronounced dead. Now his family is searching for answers, wondering how this could have happened. Take a listen. This should have happened. This should have happened. I think if there was someone watching those kids, I don't think that kid would have done that. And from what I hear, that kid, um, he's, he's bad. And district officials are denying that there was any sort of trauma that happened on the field. They say that the kids were being supervised when this incident happened. Still, his family has some very big questions about how their son died. They're holding a vigil tonight at 8 o'clock at the school here at Grant Elementary. They're urging the entire community to come out to show support for their son.